Hey, it's me, Space Cadet, with another tutorial. Uh, today I'm going to be going over some sideways stuff, some straight stuff, uh, some basic stuff, some advanced stuff, and uh, hopefully you get something out of it. Last time I tried to make one of these, I had audio issues, but I have a new mic now. Uh, my voice probably sounds a little different, but uh, hopefully you'll be able to hear me. But anyway, let's uh, let's get right into it. Alright, so let's go over some straight stuff first. Um, so my keybinds are all default. Everything, except for uh, the pedals, which are Q and E on a keyboard. So I binded those to the buttons on the side of my mouse. So the back button on the side of my mouse is Q. And the top button on the side of my mouse is E. So, I think that makes it, like, way easier because, like, when you're flying sideways and stuff, you don't have to reach all the way across your keyboard when you're trying to hold shift and E and all that stuff. But, uh, if you can do that, then more power to you. So, anyways, now that that's over, I'll get right into it. So, the whole time that I'm flying straight, I hold shift, which is your throttle. And I use my mouse for everything except for landing and uh you know flips and shit but that's not important so all of this movement that i'm doing right now is with my mouse and i use it because i feel like it makes it more smooth like i feel like i have more control and it just makes the flight look a little smoother but anyway stay nice and low try to s keep all the speed that you can see i'm going 255 right now but remember the faster you're going the longer your j-hook's gonna be and that can be good or bad or anything either or but anyways all right so i'm gonna point my helicopter left and hold z s and q all at the same time and then let go of it and float myself down with z Alright, let's do it again. So, I'm going to do it to the right this time. So it's Z, S, and E, rather than Q. So you'll go right instead of left. So if you go right, it's Z, S, and E. And if you go left, it's Z, S, and Q. Holding all of it at the same time, except for right there. I did that with just Z in my mouse. So, one thing, like, if you don't know already, if you if you just hold Z, S, and Q all at the same time, you're just going to launch yourself up in the air. So, the way to avoid that is you point your nose slightly down. Like, see how it's pointed down a little bit? You point it slightly down. And then, si and then point sideways and then use it all at the same time. That way you go down rather than way up in the air. In the same way with the right. I'm not I'm not too good with the right. I've everything that I've ever always done has been to the left, which makes no sense. I'm right handed, but I guess it doesn't matter in armor. Anyways, that's straight stuff. So I'm gonna go back to what would be independence base and restart and show you some sideways stuff all right so sideways stuff s is how you go backwards w is how you go forwards d is how you go up and a is how you go down so there's no advantages to flying sideways really i mean really all it is is to make you look cool and uh show off and you know content but uh, your landings are faster, which is cool. But um, I've been flying sideways for a year or so, I guess. And uh, it takes a lot of practice and time to get it down. But you'll get it down eventually. 
Oh, I forgot to tell you, I'm constantly holding E. It's a pedal, so I'm constantly holding my pedal. And to land, it's uh, W, D, and E all at the same time. I mean, I, I would imagine that the other way is uh, pretty sure it's W, A, and Q. Yeah, that's what it would be. I don't fly that way, so I have no idea. But, um, I'll do it again. Constantly holding E, and then W and D. I have damage turned off for the sake of editing, so don't judge that one. W, D, and E. W, D, and E. So basically what it does is just flips you around. And when you flip around, you bleed all of your speed. And all of your momentum goes downwards. So it can be pretty scary at first. But with enough practice and enough want to, you'll definitely get it. If I can do it, anyone can do it. I believe in you. So that's sideways stuff. Alright, so I'm going to go back to base, and I'll go over the advanced stuff with you, aka flips and shit. Alright, so flips and shit are completely unnecessary, and all they do is make you look cool, like sideways flying. But who cares, it's awesome, and uh, it makes you look cool, and content, you know? Yeah, so uh, there's this one, which is which is W, D, and a pedal, whichever one that you want. You can use either pedal, it doesn't really matter. It just makes it faster or slower. So this one is W, D, and Q. And this one is W, D, and E. W, D, and E is definitely slower, but it's a barrel roll. And uh, everybody knows the fucking uh, standard barrel roll, you know. Just hold, uh, hold D 50 meters in the air because you know what you're doing. No, I'm just kidding. But anyways, how to do it super low over a hill. We'll, uh, try it on this one here. And if I eat shit, then, uh, I eat shit. But anyways, you want to start maybe middle ways here. And just standard barrel roll your way over. And you can press W. So if you're upside down... And you press W, it lifts your it lifts your tail up. So if you're going if you're going super low over a hill there, and you feel like your tail is about to hit, then you can press W to raise your tail up a little bit. Maybe I can set an example. I don't know. No, I can't. I'm bad. Anyways, you see what I'm saying? All right. So standard barrel roll procedure. And, uh, I don't really know any other stuff, like, forwards. I don't think so, at least. I mean, I know some where, like, you can be really low on the ground, so. Alright, so this one, it's, uh, A, go sideways, and then W, D, and Q all at the same time. You can do that one really low to the ground. And this one is S, A, and Q. Yeah. Anyway, that's on the, that's just to show off the base. Be like, hey, bro, come, come get, come get in my helicopter, bro. I need, I need money, bro. I'm best pilot. Anyways, I'll show you some, uh, some sideways flips and shit. All right. So the front flip sideways. All you're doing is holding W all the way through and letting go of throttle which is shift default so you just yeet yourself in the air with D and then just hold W all the way through and that's the front flip and the back flip is S all the way through so yeet yourself with D again and then just hold S all the way through I was gonna hit the ground so anyways 
that what I did there was I just pressed A to uh, correct my flip. All right, so, so if you're sideways and you're scared that you're going to hit the ground, A is the way that you correct yourself, not D. Definitely not D. I've learned that so many times. So if you're going sideways and you do the front flip and you're scared you're going to hit the ground, you just hold W and then hold A. And that flips you over and you're safe. And it's the same way with the uh, with the backflip. If you're scared with the backflip, just hold A and you're straight. It's perfect. The switcheroony thing that I do and a lot of other people do is just uh, it's W, A, and Q that way. And W, D, and E that way. And w, A, and Q. And W, D, and E. Yeah. Alright, so that's all I got for you. I'm um, sorry if it was a little bland. I'm not really good at explaining it. I've probably said that in every one of my tutorials I've ever made. It's because it's true. I've been doing this for fuck, 1500 hours probably. And I don't really know how to explain it. I just know how to do it. Um, it takes a lot of practice. It takes time. It takes patience. When you first start flying, you're definitely going to want to quit. I have a friend that recently just started playing Arma. And uh, he wanted to learn how to fly helicopters. So I try to teach him the best I can. But you can't, you can't really teach someone how to fly. I mean, you can, but you can't. Everyone has their own way. Everyone has their own style. Everyone has their own flips they do. Everyone has their own everything, you know? So it's pretty hard to teach people how to fly. It's really hard to explain it. So the best thing to do is for you to buy a hummingbird or come in the editor like I am right now and uh, just get after it. Alright, okay. so that's all I got for you today. Uh, my internet is out, so I have nothing better to do. All I can do is play single player Arma, and uh, it's kind of whack, but anyway. I'll see you guys in the next video, or I'll see you guys in game, or I'll see you guys in Discord. Thank you guys for watching, and this is Space Cadet out.